Plane continuing to make its way across the Pacific Ocean this morning, threatening Hawaii as a powerful Category 5 storm. CBS 13's Lori Wallace joining us live from Sacramento International Airport with possible impacts to travel. Good morning to you, Lori. Hey there, Bethany. Good morning. There could be some problems getting out of Hawaii with booked flights, but this morning at the airport, it's been business as usual. Take a look here. There's still a couple people checking in. This flight to Honolulu leaves in just under an hour, and it has been normal. That's what the uh, airline representatives have been telling me this morning as far as people heading out and getting on their flights, despite the fact that Hurricane Lane is now a monster Category 5 hurricane. Winds at 160 miles per hour. On its current path, Lane is expected to move very close close to or even over the mainland islands from Thursday through Saturday. A hurricane warning is in effect for Hawaii County and a hurricane watch is in effect for Oahu, Maui, Lanai and Molokai. Now most people that I talked to today are headed out on vacation and they're not concerned, but we are expecting to see some people heading that way to help out their family. Actually, it's my mom and my dad and uh, my dad is half paralyzed. So I'm going to go there and help board up the windows, get the house ready, and uh, be prepared because those winds are going to get strong. You know, it's going to get really strong. Residents are stocking up on supplies, and as you just heard there, making preparations for the storm. Schools on the Big Island and in Maui County will be closed today as Hurricane Lane starts to move closer. Mudslides, rain, flash flooding, and high surf are all concerns if the center does not even reach the islands. So this is something that people are concerned with as they head out today. Of course, the rain and the bad weather, but people headed there for vacation are saying, you know what, they'll deal with it, and they're headed out anyway. But again, those flights coming back into Sacramento could be a little busy today as some people try to avoid the situation. Situation altogether. Bethany? All right, Lori Wallace, live for us this morning at Sacramento International Airport covering travel impacts from Hurricane Lane. Thank you, Lori.